this problem a can contains 40 liters of milk from this container 4 liters of milk was taken out and replaced with water the process was repeated further two times how much milk is now contained by the container in this uh, in the in liters see friends in uh, various quantitative aptitude books the formula for this particular uh, problem type of problem that is continuous replacement is given so very well a formula can be used but as far as my case is concerned i generally do not prefer to use a formula so what my logic is there see initially 40 liters of milk is there 4 liters you are drawing so milk water after this first operation is 36 and 4 right see the total quantity will remain maintained after that further you are drawing 4 liters that means 10 percent of the entire quantity so 10 percent of the milk will also be reduced so 30 from 36 10 percent will be reduced so that will come to 32.4 right uh, we are not interested in water after that further a uh, replacement is done so further 10 percent still the total quantity of milk and water will remain 40 liters because you are refilling the water so once again that 10% uh, will go so 32.5 and 10% of that is 3.24 so that's the remaining quantity is 229.16 right in seconds you can do the sum so no need to use any formula if not at all required okay I just make a quick recap 40 liters of milk was there in the first go 10 liter was replaced so from 40 to 36 we deducted uh, 10% again the same operation is being done so further 10% is reduced and further 10% is reduced so you keep on deducting 10% in two step you'll be getting your answer right and don't make the calculation of water if you are asked about the remaining quantity of water then don't make the calculation of uh, milk then you can make the calculation for water right so whatever is the ask in the question go for with that even after one step if it, one more step is asked then also you need to deduct just 2.9 percent that is around 2.2 so it can be done very easily your answer must be 27 something right so without the use of formula also this problem can be done simply